Now, Chief Meteorologist Brian Davis and your Storm Team 2 forecast. And right now we have mostly sunny skies over the area. We'll see mostly clear skies through the evening. We'll quickly drop through the 50s and into the 40s by 11 o'clock and then even reach the upper 30s here late tonight before sunrise. But up to 41 with that sun up at 8 o'clock, 58 degrees at noon, and then 66 at 5 p.m. Should be a little warmer tomorrow afternoon. Weather headlines tonight, a mainly clear sky, chilly conditions, upper 30s expected. More sunshine around the area on Friday with those highs reaching the 60s. We will have a low rain chance. That will be mainly confined to late Saturday, Saturday night, early Sunday. So a good part of the weekend when you'll be out and about. Well, uh, around the house, let's put it that way. Uh, when you're uh, around the house, maybe working out in the yard, we'll have dry conditions and temperatures still mild with those highs in the 60s. Lows tonight expected to be about 35 to 40 degrees across the Miami Valley. And then tomorrow afternoon, we'll see those temperatures warm up to the mid 60s here, upper 60s south of town, still about 60 to 65 as you go into the northern Miami Valley. And Saturday, once again, those daytime highs reaching the 60s, maybe even close to 70 degrees across the southern part of the state with cooler 50s to the west where we'll see some cloud cover and rain. Just some fair weather clouds at the start of our time lapse here a few hours ago on the Bryan Heating and Cooling Systems camera. But now some high level clouds streaming in from the northwest, but still we're expecting a mostly clear sky tonight. Live Doppler 2 HD showing the dry weather and you can just see that little patch of high clouds uh, which has been forming over northern Indiana, southwestern Michigan. That's dropping southeast, but more in the way of clear skies back to the west of us. Uh, finally, though, that cold front to the west will approach the area over the weekend, bringing us that chance of some late day rain. Currently 59 degrees in Dayton, still at our high for the day with a northwest wind 8 miles per hour and 42 percent the relative humidity. And up north, Jeff Cador and Bell Center at 56, Scott B. Secker and Bradford 55 degrees, but John Kingham 61 degrees in Tip City after a frosty start down to 32 this morning. Uh, David Wessler, New Paris in the upper 50s tonight, and Bill Telsero out in Green County looking at 61 along with Barbara Richards in Kettering. Future track forecast map keeps us mostly clear as we head through tonight. A uh, little bit of high cloudiness around tonight and tomorrow at times, but still should be mostly clear, mostly sunny. And then clouds, a uh, little more of those move into the area tomorrow night. We get back to partly cloudy conditions. And then finally on Saturday, you can see some showers to the west of us diminishing. But still, as we head towards Saturday evening, Saturday night, Sunday morning, there will be the chance for a few of those spotty showers. Mostly clear skies tonight, chilly. We drop down to 38 degrees, light variable winds. Uh, some of the outlying spots, especially north, northeast of town, could reach the mid-30s, even a little patchy frost overnight. Mostly sunny, pleasant tomorrow, and 66 degrees, that high temperature. We make it to the low 50s at 10, upper 50s at noon, into the 60s tomorrow afternoon. And then Saturday, increasing clouds, late day, that chance of showers. We still make it up to 66, maybe an early day shower Sunday, 66 again in the afternoon with some breaks in the clouds. And then around 70 on Monday, rain chances going up on Tuesday around 70, a slight chance of a shower thunderstorm Wednesday 72 and then windy and cooler weather comes back at the end of next week 62 on Thursday.